We all face challenges. We're all gonna have failures, but we all need to stay positive. If I can take those lessons and help other people, I'd like to do that. And that's, that's the point of Blue Glasses. So the idea for Blue Glasses probably started when Luke was born. And to tell you a little bit more about Luke and his history, Luke was born in 2004, and Luke was born with a very rare chromosome disorder. My husband and I heard a lot of he may nevers. Early on, he may never smile. He may never get out of bed. He may never crawl. He may never walk. He may never eat solid food. I couldn't live with that. And I decided that I can make a choice every morning when I get up, and I chose to be positive. I chose to believe that Luke would crawl, that Luke would walk, that Luke would do all these things that nobody else could tell me that he would do. So we set goals and we did a lot of therapy with Luke. And I'll tell you, he had the best attitude through it all. He went to those appointments and lo and behold, Luke smiled at four weeks. Luke crawled, Luke walked. Now he was over four years old, but he walked with a walker. And when he took that first step, my husband and I got a bottle of champagne and we celebrated. The messages and the inspirational messages that are on the apparel from Blue Glasses really speak to who Luke is and the positive message that he spreads and um, we're all better for it. Felicia and I met Glenn and Vicki probably 12, maybe even 13 years ago now at a support group for kids with different special needs and we, uh, we met Luke at the same time and we were immediately drawn to Luke and just his, his really positive, really cool spirit. We've remained great friends since then. He immediately bonded with our older daughter Emma uh, and we now have our younger daughter Allison and when Glenn and Vicki told us about the idea of blue glasses, we were so excited and just so happy for them and thought what a great idea to share Luke's story and what a great little guy he is. Plus you get to wear some cool clothes and money goes to help other families with disabilities and um, we were just super excited to hear about it and be a part of it and we're glad to be a part of their extended family. I also feel strongly about employing people with disabilities. One of my goals is to hire people with disabilities to help me make my t-shirts and my bags and ultimately a portion of my profit goes back to organizations that support people living with disabilities. Luke Christensen is my nephew and I'm very, very proud of him. He's shown me how to face challenges with a smile, with a positive attitude, and he's actually been somebody who I've learned a great deal from. Uh, he shows me that any challenge put in front of him can be overcome, and I think people like Luke uh, are, are teachers in many ways for people that maybe don't have challenges that they have. I think the best word to describe Luke is he's heart. He's all heart. Um, he gives his best and even the people who look at him and say, oh, you know, he might not be able to do this or, you know, he's walking slow so it's going to take him a while. Luke will get to that. He's just special. I mean, as weird as that word is, you know, people have so many different meanings behind it. He's just, he's just a special kid. I'm just very lucky to have a brother like him. And I, I like it because it puts a lot of challenges to me. And since I get to see that every day, it makes me feel nice. We're unique in the sense that we have a son with a rare chromosome disorder, but we're not unique that we face challenges. And if some of the lessons that I've learned along the way, the phrases that you see in my shirts, the inspirational sayings, can help someone facing a challenge. That's what I'm passionate about. That is the point. That is the purpose of Blue Glasses. <laughs>